and gentlemen, it gives me a great deal of pleasure to present to you Reverend Vernon King, pastor of St. James Baptist Church of Greensboro, North Carolina. Reverend King. It wasn't necessarily your parents. It wasn't necessarily your degree. It wasn't your job. It wasn't your street sense. It was the grace of God that has brought us where we are today. And my uncle understood that, and that's what fueled his fire. That's what fueled his passion, for he understood that he was on a mission for God to make America a better place. Well, the truth of the matter is, we thank God for what has happened. But my uncle wrote a book, Chaos Community, Where Do We Go From Here? On Tuesday, we will have a great celebration. But on Wednesday, what do we do next? I mean, do we sit back and diagnose the problem? Blame everybody else? I do rejoice in the fact that we will be able to watch the inauguration of President Obama. But the truth of the matter is, one man cannot change the problems that we must face in America. Because if you look at it, foreclosure is not a black issue. Unemployment is not a black issue. for us to come together. I thank God that we're going to have round table discussions today because we must first understand to fulfill Marcus' dream, we must deal with our youth. They don't know the struggles. They don't know the history. The only thing they know about is making a dollar. And they don't care who they have to rob, who they have to steal, who they, don't, who they have to kill. We've got to teach them the value of education. We've got to teach them that there's no honor in going to jail. have a very great sense of oratory and it was truly a gift from God but the reality of it was that he was an ordinary man just like everybody else amen If we want to finish my uncle's dreams, we must work together. Yeah.